Hi, I'm Raleigh, and I'm a sophomore. Hi, I'm Brianna, and I'm a junior. I'm Zoe, and I'm a junior. I'm Belle, and I'm a senior. And we're from Jishen Academy. We're in shopping. And this is our group piece called the Panopticon. I sat on my filthy, wrinkled couch on a cool March night. I, I love, love the Oscars. Oscars. I love watching the celebrities. Through the screen, a fluorescent eye peered into mine. Her ultraviolet skin reflecting an, an unceasing glow. And in that moment, I knew I wanted to become a cherry-lipped goddess like her. We, we all, all love fame. We crave it. We love saturating our minds with the heady alcohol of gossip and scandal. Our, our cold souls revive through the new drama of melancholic yet vivid actors and actresses. We crave, we crave stories, stories. Stories that explicitly tell of a once ordinary, ordinary person. A metamorphosis from misfortune to success. The catastrophes of ourselves become relevant. But as we grow up, we, we are commemoration of starved innocence. Eccentric youth become bloodhounds. In our anonymity, we lack sentiment. We, we crave to know each other's sins and sorrows, so, so we, we don't, don't have, have to learn those lessons ourselves. ourselves. Our essences cohere in our natural state of darkness. We are the audience. We, we want, want to be here. Envy consumes our every fiber. Sparked, Sparked by the presence of these stars. We crave it. We, we want, want to be noticed. noticed. You get noticed. You seek validation in double taps and thumbs up. You show off your body and, and leak those news. news. Your life is a reality show because everyone loves to laugh at people. Funnier, Funnier or richer or we're dumber than them. Famous people are there for the entertainment of the masses. Get used to tabloids revealing scandals about your life. Who cares if it's true? Who cares if you donate thousands of dollars to charity? All anyone wants to know is what outfit you wore today. Everyone wants to be famous, you think. Everyone wants to own fancy cars and multiple houses empty, empty as, as their lives. lives. Does it start to feel like a prison? Concrete walls called adoration. The bars made of camera flashes blinding. blinding. Your prison made of ever-watching eyes crawling, crawling across, across your, your body. body. Your decisions analyzed under a microscope. Being dissected is fun, you tell yourself. Your innards poked at as a study of human experience. Has your perfume turned into formaldehyde? Reeking a false vivacity and fake smiles. Weakness, ugliness, reality are, are no longer normal. normal. They are too normal. Plaster, Plaster a dazzling, dazzling smile on your face day by day. You, you cannot, cannot relinquish the knowledge that you are constantly on display. Moderate your own behavior. Your mind evolves into a cage. It's, it's called the panopticon, our prison. prison. We are bound by the possibility of eyes at all times. We never know if the camera is rolling. If what, if what we say and do will live forever on the internet, we cannot escape the possibility of the camera. And therefore, we must always be prepared for it. Our lives are not our own. We are famous. 